Hello and welcome to At Home with Natalie, where we visit some of our favorite people's favorite places. Today we're visiting the brand new home of one of the world's best skiers, Michaela Schifrin, here in gorgeous Edwards, Colorado. Now you know her for all her accomplishments on the slopes, but today we're going to get a look at what her life looks like off the slopes. Let's go ring that brand new doorbell. Hi, I'm Michaela. Hello. Michaela! Oh my god. Welcome. Uh, thank you. Oh my gosh, this place is amazing. Thank you. First time I walked in here, it was not anything like this. I mean, yeah. it was probably halfway through construction. So all of this is sort of the vision and what I kind of wanted to do with it, like the wood, all it's all I love that. reclaimed wood. It's a hundred years old. Oh my gosh, and then it amazing. Comes, it comes from Austria. And the, Austria being important to you, I know. you ski there a lot. Well, now mm -hmm. I see where you keep some of your trophies. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, I know, highlighting oh, the trophies. Oh my gosh, but they're beautiful. Thank you. Look at those, amazing. And tell me about this fireplace in your yes. living room. There's sort of certain styles that I picked up from traveling in Europe. Different hotels we go to yeah. have kind of a zen feeling. And there's one specific hotel I went to that had this sort of bronze, copper, patina, like metal. And I was like, that's, it's so, it's cool. And it's modern. Like I, I sort of have this modern. You've got a mix of old and new. Of, yeah. yeah. And you helped really from, from picking out the flooring to every detail in well, this house. I was house. like drawing and painting pictures of this wall, like this. I love that video that your mom posted where you're like, oh my gosh. Yeah. The first Everywhere. time you walk in, you're like, oh my gosh. I know, my poor parents. I was like, you guys have to get all of this on video because like, you only step into your first house of your life once. So you're a kitchen girl. I'm a kitchen girl. All right. Love to cook. Wow, look at this view. You've, of course, been in some of the most beautiful places in the world, but I imagine when you stick that key in the door and yeah. you walk in this place. It's a sanctuary. This was one of the pieces, I don't know where I had seen this even, but I had this idea. I wanted a big, big island. And wow. uh, when we were looking at the original drawings for the kitchen, I was like, this island is amazing. It's perfect. We have to do something stunning. So what kind of, is this marble? It's, it's like an quartzite. quartzite. It's unbelievable. Oh my gosh. Ta-da! <laughs> In the evening, it like lights up the room. It's oh my so gosh. cool. And it, but when you look in it, it yeah. looks like ice. Like a like glacier. Like what you ski on. Yeah. <laughs> so it fits you. <laughs> and that was, yeah. We kind of matched everything to how, or got yeah. everything in the house to match this. To match you. Yes. Yes, because it's your first house. <laughs> yeah. And you know what I love about this is that your family, of course, lives here with you. Yeah. I mean, it's so important for you to have them here and a part yeah. of your life, right? Well, I'm only really home maybe yeah. two months out of the year max. Um, so when I am home, it is important for me to be able to be around family. I'm lucky that they were willing to do this again with me because I, I don't think I would have been able to move here and live here mm -hmm. alone and kind of live in my dream house as my first house if they weren't willing to do that. All right, shall we go check out some of the rest of your favorite places? Yes. We are going downstairs to my bedroom. This is like my lair, Ooh. kind of. Your she cave? Yeah, this is my she cave. <laughs> oh, wow. So this is my bedroom. Wow. Oh my gosh. And you're not I here know. that often to do that, but when you wake up here, <laughs> What is that feeling? It's it's so nice, and you, yeah. I splurged on um, yeah. mechanical sh shades, so I have a little button that like opens the blinds. Um, wow. I also have blackout shades, so in the morning it's like pitch black, but yeah. I open them up and it's just like open it up to this view, open it up to this light. It's become sort of my routine. Wow. Like when my alarm goes off, I open the shades, and then I naturally wake up rather than pressing snooze. I see a feature that I love out your window, but we'll get to that later. We'll get to that later. <laughs> Let's go check out one of my favorite rooms is the, the bathroom. The bathroom closet. Oh, this is the uh, shower where you can dance in. Yeah. It's so big. Look There's at that. There's space for days. You can go to a dance in here. And the mirrors cold. light up, which is great. It's great, especially if you're doing makeup. It yes. gives you a nice, even lighting. 
This is your Sex and the City closet. Look at this. Another this is like sanctuary. your Carrie Bradshaw. Look at all those shoes. I know. Yeah, you got to get the shoes. Oh, my oh gosh. Oh, my gosh. I know you have a lot of favorites in this closet. Besides your shoe collection, is there another collection that you keep here as well? Okay. These are, these are some World Champs medals. Oh, gosh. Wow. Some, some of them. Some of the how many? <laughs> oh, that's a good question. 17 just this past um, season. So, well, <laughs> these are the Olympic rings. Mm. Oh my gosh. You can tell which that. one's older, right? This one's like yeah. dusty. This is, yeah, it's a treasure chest. Yes. That's Kyung the Chang. silver. Ooh. <laughs> I love the cases they come in. Wow. I know. They're really pretty. There's, There's gold. the gold. This was for the slalom. This is for the giant slalom. This is for the combined. Amazing. And this one is the first gold from the first. One. Oh my gosh! Wow. And you're going to be adding to this collection. I mean, you got many, many years <laughs> to go. I mean, how much are you in 2022 mode already? You know, you never really get out of it. Yeah. Because we do have the World Cup circuit every season starts in October, ends in March, and. In a way, like you saw kind of the trophy case um, upstairs, there's also yeah. a, a sort of trophy shelves down here. The, the season titles, the globes, are in a way as important to me as any of these medals. Yeah. Um, because it sort of a, signifies consistency throughout a season, performance throughout a season, and throughout your career. So when, when I was little, my goal was to be the best in the world, and not just to win on Olympic medal because winning an Olympic medal doesn't mean you're the best in the world. It just means you were the best on that day. You know, you just came off your best season ever though. I mean, incredible. <laughs> and you are the first skier to hit the $1 million paycheck, which in, a, in this day and age where we're talking about women's equality, yeah. especially in sports for you to take that title. I mean, that's gotta it's, mean a lot. It's really cool. Yeah. And it's so special to participate in a sport yeah. where the prize money is equal, male to female. I honestly think it's been that way since mm -hmm. the beginning. <laughs> we kind of started looking back into the record books, like when did they start with that? But I think since they since they established prize money in ski racing, it was always equal with yeah. the men and women. That's been really cool. And it's been definitely a hot topic lately because yeah. because I am the first to hit one million in prize money. And yeah, you know, the, accomplishment. the opportunity is there and that's, that's what, you know, that's what we're looking for. And so many little girls look up to you for that. Can I try one of these rings Yes, on? you can. Okay, I'm just gonna say. Oh, it looks good on me, I know. It looks beautiful on you. I think it's something <laughs> where you should layer it. Oh, yes, I'm into layering, as you can tell. <laughs> Gorgeous. I'm layer. I like that you have speakers in your closet, too. You can bring the dance party oh, yeah. in there. Speakers everywhere. I've had more dance parties in this closet than really? anywhere. Really? Like, yeah, it's. Wow. So this is another favorite room of the house. Wow. Then maybe this is the heart of the home. This yeah. couch. This couch took a long time to come fit. Wow. It took a long time to pick because I was traveling so much. Yeah. Well, I love the shape of it too. It kind of yeah. brings you all in together a little bit, but yet you can also stretch out and have a nice nap. Your right. favorite thing to do. Exactly. And like it's, <laughs> it needs to be a napping couch, a yes. chill couch, a movie watching couch. Like put your feet up or also host a, a nice formal party couch. It needs to fit all of those things and they yeah. found it. I okay. love it. You can like Yes. It's legitimate the Amazing. most comfortable thing. Wow. Okay. Final favorite piece. Wow. Um, okay, so but this is important for your recovery, yeah, right? Yeah, it's a therapy pool. Okay, can I dip my feet in? Um, I can't sit here alone. No, <laughs> I'm coming to join you. I love having you share your home with us, yeah. and there's so much heart and soul in here already that I can't wait to see all the memories you create here. Thank Congratulations. You. Thank you. I'm so excited. Yay. Our girl, Michaela. <laughs> Hey, NBC News viewers, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.